I'm tired. It's late, but I wanted to say a couple of things, and I'm slightly sad because I just watched Liz Liz's long paper of names and everybody talk because I'm watching the L.A. thing protest uh, for all night long. Came from Austin. Uh, then went out and we went to 4th Street in Berkeley, which is a really cool outdoor street turned into turning into sort of a mall thing. And I went to a famous cosmetic store that starts with an S and a salesperson came up and asked if they could help and I was looking for a new eye cream because I'm old and vain. And we started talking about, guess what? Scientology. So she has the brain I do, which is give us a great subject and we'll just start squirreling. That's what we've always called it. Squirreling into the subject for hours, days, months. And I got her interested and told her that I have been or have started to do San Francisco. So I might have somebody who's interested in it. I also... The hubby was actually nice enough to fix my video yesterday, so it's not sideways anymore. And I just don't sound like me. I, It's really weird how I sound. Um, I used to call it the go to hell voice and have a good time. So because doing uh, ticket lists and guest lists and things like that for 20 odd years, when somebody wouldn't listen to me, I would start talking like this. And just go, no, I can't do anything for you. I am so very sorry. And somebody once said, it is my F up and have a nice day voice. So that's what I sound like. I can actually watch my own videos because I don't hear that voice at all. And I can see myself and it's okay. Um, I'm not as horribly horrible as I thought I was. So that's good. But it was just not me. I, it was so funny. I'm listening going, I could listen to this person talk because that's not what it sounds like to me. What it sounds like to me is about half an octave lower. So um, my the hubby teases me about my voice and says it sounds like a friend of mine who's got a really high voice when I make fun of the cats and talk in the cat voice. No, go away, leave me alone. He says I sound like somebody and I can believe it now. So I invited someone to uh, Scientology. Uh, it made me eat ice cream today because everybody went with Streets LA to the ice cream store down the street from the garbage can. And so I had to have my ice cream. And what else? Uh, Austin was hilarious because it was such a small like area I was watching Leah's live and when she did the backup you saw how small it was it was so funny um oh yeah and the nails are green and yellow so that was on purpose too so not only is it turns into the yellow color but it looks like insect back so Scientology or insects I don't know um, what else? I think that's it for the moment. I'm pretty darn tired. Um, it's been a long day. I've pet a lot of dogs. Uh, I've seen dragons and that's why I didn't go to Scientology and SF today because it was the Chinese New Year Parade. Uh, but they were on 4th Street, uh, blessing all the stores. So there were three little dragons running around. So it was cool. And we were watching them and a couple of them looked at me, so we've I've got good uh, luck for the year, and it's the year of the dragon, which wouldn't make sense to a lot of people. And I'm not Chinese, so I'm actually native. So, um, but it's where I grew up, Oakland. You learn everything in Oakland. So, when Chinese New Year comes around, it's a big. It was a big deal when I was growing up. So used to the envelopes, the dragons, you try to get good luck, you know, stuff like that. So, but the, um, 
parade is right one of the staging areas i think at the beginning is right where scientology is there uh because chinatown's a block away so we didn't go today um and i saw uh davy was down in la and he was at the live at the garbage can and i was just i texted him and said i am so jealous so um got rid of the fomo so that was good uh but it was really neat and like i said i wanted to say that i actually told someone about scientology her and i sat there and just clicked like clacked like chickens for about 20 minutes and risked a parking ticket because we were over time but she just had that look in her eyes like she was gonna go home and go play on the internet for the rest of the night so i have done something good today for getting people interested in getting rid of that place so that's it for now i am going to pretend to not go to sleep so don't go to sleep till two most of the time which is not necessarily good or bad but hopefully be able to post a video from for tomorrow and like i said the hubby fixed the sideways video because i didn't know it stayed there um and everything else is hunky dory i'm in my living room right now because i wanted to post this before bedtime anyway so that's it for today guys have a good night and hopefully i'll get more subscribers tomorrow bye